All right, Mass 52. Here's the new header installed. There's a couple of issues. Um, the O2 center bone needs to be rotated forward because it actually physically touches the oil filter. I have no way of replacing the oil filter or the O2 now. I would have to actually remove all seven bolts from this to do that. By the way, um, M8 1.25 one and a half inch bolts are perfect for this. Um, so I can either get a oil filter relocation kit to move this and then it'll be out of the way, but you have more problems. Um, this bolt can't be loosened with a ratchet. I had to do, I had to actually uh, loosen all the other bolts, slide the whole entire manifold out, get a wrench in there so I can tighten that up as I brought the manifold in, and then tighten these up, and then I could finish tightening that, and I couldn't get a um, torque wrench on there, so I had to guess. Um, so what you can do is just straighten this tube out um, and come straight down, which is actually what you should do. This tube, as I see how this tube here is moving toward the passenger side, this tube actually needs to come straight down because this is in the wrong place. Um, this whole entire joint here needs to be more toward the driver's side and more forward. Um, I had to really bend and contort to even get the original catalytic converter and the new one won't fit at all because this needs to come over this way and over this way, forward and toward the driver's side a bit. Um, so O2 bone needs to be rotated forward a little bit. This entire joint needs to come more toward the driver's side and farther forward, and this tube should come straight out and go down 90 degrees to this joint. And um, that would do it. That would fix everything. And I'd also like this tube to be bigger. So on future ones, I would use a bigger tube so this hole is bigger. We should be able to stick a wire through here and router this. Um, um, this has, I hope I can get away with just keeping this one. Um, if I can get this to fit, I might still be able to keep this one. I could um, have someone um, If I have someone cut that off and move it up you know, two inches That one inch maybe that should be enough to allow the new one to fit But only if I can find an oil filter relocation kit I have to be able to find an oil filter relocation kit because otherwise these two pieces conflict. I can't unscrew the oil filter because it has to go through the end of the O2. I can't unscrew the O2 because it has to go through the oil filter. If I find an oil filter relocation kit, I can just crush this, take it off, and then put the oil filter relocation kit on, and then the bung will be fine. But that still leaves this in the wrong place. There's actually a gap here. I'm hoping the lead donut is enough to cover that gap. Um, because it's not, it's not in the right position. It's too far this way. Um, I'm hoping it don't leak. I really don't want to take it all off now, especially since I broke the studs. And I can't put the original manifold back on. And go from there.